morning. Looks like you're ready to catch some serious fish. ready to catch some serious fish. I wish, young gal. It's like, I would if I was out on the water, but they stole my boat. Has the town changed much? By Neptune's beard, it has. By Neptune's beard. Wow, nerd, why don't you calm down? We gotta use that nerd day conversation now. You did good. I don't know what it did. I don't know what you did, but it was probably good. Until the Prescotts and their finance fiends. Oh, no. Finance fiends. The Prescotts have a lot of power. They have a lot of power and a lot of bullshit. Prescott Bay, if that tells you much. They own my school. They own my school. Crooks gain respect Pretty when they much. put their names on schools and libraries. Schools and libraries. I hear the fish calling for Bali High. Never forget the that fuck old does that even mean? I don't know. We just smell that way. Never die. We just smell that I'd way. I'd love to learn more, but I have to get going. Happy fishing out there. I'd love to learn more, but, you know, breakfast. Is there a trucker? That's, is that a trucker guy? Not really. Just talk to that guy. Then. It's man. Excuse me. Hello. Sir? Can you believe this town? The world is on fire, <laughs> and our big headline is snow. This dude's starting in quick. Story. Yeah, he's not happy. Snow was odd. The snow was pretty odd. It was right in the middle of a warm, sunny day. <sighs> Global warming bullshit. Global warming the bullshit. Snow happens. I keep reading. This is the David Cage thing. You show more emotion. <laughs> this guy's laying it on pretty thick. Yeah, for some dude who's just sitting outside the newspaper. Yeah. Stand mm -hmm. thing. Rachel Amber. I guess. I bet she ran away because she was bored. Who wouldn't be here? <laughs> All right, never mind. Well, see you later. There's a trucker somewhere. Maybe he's inside here. When he comes outside, you can talk to him and take a picture of his truck, and that's a picture. Mm. Man, that smell of breakfast and the sound of clanging silverware. Ah, it's just like a diner, huh? Makes you feel 13 again. What's going on? Don't even take a booth. <laughs> Sit up at the bar with the rest of the <laughs> locals. Take in the color. Ah. Hey, that was tray flip guy. Yeah. Coffee. Six cups of coffee, coffee, please. And there she is, lovely young woman. How are you doing? How are you doing, Max? Do I know you? It's nice to see you again. You look the same. Only older. You don't look a day over fifty. Seventy-five, Max. Nice save, kid. You're still smart. Except you've been here to help save Chloe. Oh, she got busted yesterday smoking out. Fun fact, I was there. Didn't do anything. Chloe told me that her stepfather hit her. I am sorry that was your introduction to David. I hope you get to know him on your terms, not Chloe's. He's a good I get to know him on any terms, like, goddamn, yeah, please. Sure <laughs> Don't help with my life. Is it Don't Joyce? <laughs> it's good you're here. I was hoping you could be a I moved to Seattle. Right I'm a big I name mean, now. I don't need to promise. eat this fucking two whales. Go to Seattle and have close. three whales. <laughs> and I sell nothing but I'm whales. Folks in Seattle, I'm all alone at Blackwell. Completely it's stranded. You moved forward with your life. I did after William passed See, on. I got berated because I, I took the rest of the pot. She's like... Anyway, I hear you smoke a pot in my house. <laughs> Max Caulfield, don't you do that shit in my house. So sorry about don't you bring that Seattle into my house. Don't you bring that Seattle. That was his gift to us. Wonderful memories. Wonderful Even memories. Chloe doesn't understand yet. Chloe has changed. <laughs> She's not a pirate anymore. <laughs> She used to be pirates. I see you have the same couch. We broke it once. <laughs> she just needs time. I know that sucks for you. She does. She, she just needs time, places, and she'll have away, that time because I can rewind it. Bad boys, tattoos, piercings, blue hair, drugs, 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 green hair, blue hair again. I see why. I mean, normal hair that one week. What did Chloe tell you? I already told you that Chloe said David hit her. Yeah, so say it again. Well, Chloe texted me that David slapped her yesterday. He feels awful, and he will be punished. 
He's not getting any of this for a while. And by this, I mean bacon and eggs. He does care about her. Here at the local two whales. <laughs> what can I get you? Please come again. <laughs> no excuse to hit her. That's no excuse to hit a girl. He's an adult. I don't He's like an it, adult. Either, Max. David swore it would never happen again. He's true to his word. I just want us to be a family soon. I guess it's not going to happen, Joyce. Let's be a family it. soon, rather than being a family later. So, now let's get down to the nitty gritty. What are we going to eat? Do you want this is the eat? biggest decision in the whole game. We something fantastic. So, I know which one I went with. Fuck omelets. The last good Belgian waffle I had was Belgian waffle. Thirteen years old. You like eggs now? Don't even try. It. Bring it on. <laughs> Now finish your coffee. No, you got it wrong. I like beer now. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> one Belgian waffle for the hungry. The only thing that's changed on the menu are the prices. Why does she say one? She's clearly cooking the food. Is she reminding herself? <laughs> I think she's got to cook somewhere. I love she's at the grill right now. Of breakfast. You don't grill a... Waffle. Warren must have been here. Quit talking about Warren. <laughs> A cup of Seattle's finest. I'm not in Seattle anymore. Dimensional deja vu. Arcadia Bay. I keep going back in time. No beer. Looks like you. No beer. Stick with the bacon. It's like fucking eight in the morning. Eight forty-five. Where's that bitch, Chloe? <laughs> The lighthouse looks so mysterious. It looks so mysterious. I, I wonder if I could write a romance novel about it. <laughs> I guess I actually can now. But then it wouldn't be a moment. Incoming. Incoming. She just <laughs> winks <laughs> like a frisbee. I can hear your stomach. There's gotta be a better way to do that. Here, you'll love this. You love this. I put some I'm shit on it. <laughs> Baby's drool. Yeah. Huh. When I look at pictures of Chloe, uh, I remember when y'all were pirates and spilled wine on my. Speak, speak of the devil. the devil. Speak of the bitch. I thought I kicked you out of here. Mom and Max together again. When Chloe. Chloe. Noon. <laughs> Just getting up. Haven't changed I'm your pants yet. <laughs> no, you're not. This is my treat to you. For coming back to rescue my daughter. Nobody so pissed. Yeah. Unless you set your room on Super fire rebellious. Smoking out. Oh, God. smoking out. Didn't you and Sergeant Pepper already read me the riot? Sergeant I'm Pepper. Call him David if you don't want to be lectured. You only get one damn slice of bacon a day. Oh damn. Oh, you can't. You can't just have you one slice of bacon. Really That's <laughs> impossible. I don't want to sit. Too edgy for that. Well, I will cool guy stand on this, sit on this table. What kind of hardcore gangster shits on this jukebox? Oh yeah, Tupac. <laughs> yeah, this is my jam. <laughs> Let's talk about your superpower. I don't. Let's talk about the fact that you can rewind time really loud. <laughs> also, ketchup and Tabasco. I like Tabasco. Proof you can this is all time. happening so fast. We'll start slow. Right here, now. <laughs> like, well, here's proof she reached across the table and punches her in the eye. Oh! <laughs> and then she goes back, and she's just sitting, Max is just sitting there with her arms crossed, like, did that hurt? <laughs> what the hell are you talking about, Max? <laughs> I just punched you in the face and <laughs> rewound rewind time. Fuck, I don't know. What's she, keys. Keys? Your what's she got in her keys? What's she got in her keys? She got her pocket. I need details. Describe, Describe the keychain. It is bullet. bullet. Just like your necklace. That was so wrong. Oh, I got it wrong. Okay, psychic girl. Skull. Let me show you what's actually in my pockets. Let me load them in. That was beyond like a bear. epic fail. You even made me want to believe you. That's beyond epic fail. How dare you say such a thing to me? You look and see what it is. Study every item and don't Panda bear Panda bear keychain. Yeah. Smokes. Six. Wait. Three. Seven. Let's see. Seventy-five. Eighty-six. Eight. One, two, three, four, five, six. 
Parking ticket. 1034. Do not park in this area again. <laughs> okay. Back. I'm going to tell you what's in your pockets. This fist! <laughs> Max goes back and she's just like, okay, I'll tell you what's inside your pockets. She's like, I wasn't going to ask you what's inside my pockets. Cigarettes. Pretty sure you have cigarettes on you. Yes, you know I'm a smoker. Uh, when but don't I? Seven. Seven cigarettes. A superpower that allows you to count cigarettes. Cool. <laughs> Amazing. It's the best power to have. Keys. Your car keys. Duh, way too easy. I need details. Describe my keychain. It was a panda. A cute robot panda keychain. Not bad, Super Max. You, you got do it. have that Irish luck, Caulfield. What else? <laughs> you had a parking, parking ticket. ticket. You know me well. But what is the exact time? It's ten forty-five, right? Ten thirty-seven. Ten thirty-seven. That's not a one. Ten thirty-four. <laughs> ten thirty-four a.m. Booyah! Max can tell time. Even a broken <laughs> clock is right twice a day. Max just but like I mean. cheated on that one. I was there when you got that party ticket. Mm. Money. Some money. Clearly, I'm rich as fuck. How much do I have? Rich as fuck. Eighty-six, 86 cents. cents. That's right. Living large in Arcadia Bay. Holy shit! You knew everything in my pocket. <laughs> You she, she also has David's gun. She found an extra penny in there. She's like, wrong, 87. You're wrong. <laughs> or she I lost a penny. All over my neck. <laughs> One just like fell out of her hand as she was getting out of her pocket. 85, you idiot. <laughs> I'll take that she also used the phrase amaze balls. <laughs> yeah. Sure, Mom. Take that crap off the table. She it's had, it's the okay, feeling? Mom. I was just showing I her that... I could, Very good that's, save. Max could rewind time. Also, Man, I'm not to wolf. ruin continuity here, uh, Chloe had sausage on her plate and not bacon. Yeah. You, you have to so she didn't more. get her you one strip of bacon, no. she got none strip of bacon. Double punishment for smoking weed in the house. <laughs> smoking out. <laughs> Here's what's gonna happen. Those two fight. Trucker's gonna get a thing. Cop's gonna leave. Mm, things gonna jukebox. She walks out, looks at us, yep. waves. Oops. Did Coffee you pot breaks. Cup? Or a cup. No cup breaks. Now I gotta take this call and leave my breath. And then the cop gets a call out the window. You're a dick. Don't slap me, bitch. Take your fight club. Those two get in a fight. He started it. And... I'm finishing it. Is that it? Yep. Oh, and then music comes on. Yep. Better than that other garbage. I think our jukebox is headed for Davy Jones's locker. So, okay. what are you waiting for? Now I should rewind and tell Chloe everything. I'm gonna go. Happened. I'm gonna tell Chloe everything that happened, for whatever reason. I'm going to. Okay. Four events that will happen in the next. Only need four. So. We can strike out on the other ones. Trucker okay. drops his glass. Or the mug. Yeah, Tucker. Tr it, no, trucker. Trucker drops his mug. The trucker drops his mug and Joyce, Joyce rips, rips him, him a new one. one. So, what happens next? Let's see. Alert on cop's radio and his partner leaves. Yep. The cop gets an emergency alert on his radio and his partner in the car leaves without him. Well, let's just so. see how this goes down. And then Justin and Trevor are fighting and Joyce beats them. <laughs> yeah. Justin and Trevor are fighting and Joyce breaks it up. Fighting and Joyce breaks it up. Good. Can't wait to see what happens. And then Jukebox goes crazy. I think it's as a cockroach. A uh, cockroach on crawls on it, yeah. Yeah. It's either cockroach crawls on it or a fly lands on it. The cockroach, the cockroach. Jukebox goes he crawled crazy against as the floor. Cockroach crawls on it. Pretty bizarro, Max. Cockroach. Well, let's see if everything happens like you said. All right. Oh, I think we nailed it because we're getting in cutscene for. Yeah, we're getting cutscene. Yeah. Hello. Oops. <laughs> Did you break another cop? Oh, wait, really? Go, Mom. No refill for you. <laughs> <laughs> no really refill for you, Pricko. 
Hey, touch me, bitch. Part? Hey, where's my part? You're a dick. Don't slap me, bitch. Take your fight club. Don't slap me, bitch. He, started he sounds like I'm fucking crazy. Aziz and sorry to me when he says that. I know. Cockroach. I pledge allegiance to Max and the power for which she stands. This isn't a toy. Bow to me, for I am your new time god. I am your new lord. <laughs> She's a time lord, obviously. <laughs> No Shout outs to all the time <laughs> words out there. <laughs> See, we're hitting new demographics with terms like that. Yes. You could also get that by saying the word TARDIS. That's fucking insane. We have to play. I don't have time. You did not just say that. Boom. You got maxed. Check out your nose. Too much blow? A little. Yeah. You okay? I had a little before it came in. See what happens when we hook up again? Then let's go Super to one of my secret lairs and fully test your power. You need a sidekick to guide you. Secret me. lair. We are a, a superhero so duo. I can rewind time and you have a you gun. You didn't finish your waffle. You didn't even finish your bacon. That crazy <laughs> shit she has in mind now. Don't right say goodbye to Joyce. I don't think you can. Goodbye, Trunker. By Officer Justin. Okay. So isn't this when you get a okay, Supergirl. text Let's go massage? To no. Don't even okay. answer. You get a phone call. Places oh, yeah. This is going to be blue. Do. Let's bail. It's Kate Marsh from Blackwell. Big whoop. You don't call me once in five years, and now you're all over some biatch you see every day at school? I see how you roll. Looks like so we've got a lot of choice to make. Kate Marsh from Blackwell. I've got other Which choice are you gonna make? <laughs> Last time I did this one. I, I did this one. Let's go with this one yeah. this time. Let's do this one. Hey Kate. I gotta take What's this. Please don't let your it friend helps. <laughs> I promise, Kate. Because now they have a nice I'm chat. Yeah, they have a nice little chit chat. Just do your homework and don't About stress. About step douche. I really don't think we should go into this right now. I'll call you later, okay? I'll call you later on my Samsung Galaxy. Thanks, Max. Pretty much what it looks like. That looks like my phone. Because I now have a Samsung Galaxy phone. I'm chilling with you, okay? Chilling now, with you, alright? Let's rock. So I take a phone call. She's having a rough day. Like Max could have just explained it like that. She was like, having a rough day. Chloe and Joyce got into an argument. She had a rough day. She had a rough day yesterday, too. Kate. That's a good framing. <laughs> that's a good framing device. <laughs> Chloe's just like. I think they meant to do it that way to frame it like that. Well, yeah, probably. So that's why they have her staring back up at the door, waiting for your sorry ass. With Rachel Amber in the picture, also. She's, she's like, "Well, fuck, come on, you know how to work a door, Max." I don't remember how. Chloe is a push or pull. Creepo. He's kind of creepy. I don't like him. I beat him up. Is it Warren? No. Warren doesn't wear a hat. Warren could wear a hat. <laughs> Warren's too big of a nerd to wear a hat. Warren could wear a coffin around him if he plays his cards right. <laughs> What a fancy place for a secret lair. Would you... You're, you're 18, right? Uh, Would you hang out at a place like this? No. No? There's no electricity. How am I going to play my video games? You weren't, you weren't super big into games back then. Not then. You were starting to, but you weren't... You were, you were more casual. You were, you were getting there. Well, like, right as I was graduating in high school, that's when I got GTA 4. And that was the first GTA game that I played for, like, the story, rather than just fucking around with it. Yeah. Well, I say beginning of senior year. 17 to 18. You weren't super into... You were you were a casual. You were a filthy casual, let's be fair. Still want to hang out in a place like this? No. What, what would draw you away from it? Frank? Yeah, he's fucking filthy. So <laughs> you haven't changed a bit. 
I would totally hang out at a place like okay, this. Let's do this. This would be a cool place to hang out. Anyway. To be fair, when we were that age, we were hanging out in a garage. Yeah. A yeah. filthy garage. <laughs> we were playing fucking Metal Gear to, with your fucking football gloves on because my after after fan controller would shut off. <laughs> We might have to do this, this bottle getting game on the next time. On the next time? That's fair. On the next go around. We learned a lot this week. <laughs> this session, I guess. We learned that Warren got a black eye. Yep. We got invited. We're going to a party with those friends. Yeah, we're going to the Halloween shindig. Yeah. Mm -hmm.